everyone. It's Jessica Edwards in Wilmington, North Carolina. So I read something online last night about, you know, you're always hearing things about there are so many people with real estate licenses and in the real estate industry. And what what is that difference? What is that tipping point, if you will? Or what is that difference that makes some agents so successful and so many, many agents just mediocre or kind of just getting by? And the, the response was actually um, Barbara Corcoran. And her response was, or her thoughts on this sort of topic, if you will, that might have not been it exactly, was basically that the difference is not how hard agents work or how many people they contact or how they run their business. The difference is resilience. And, and the difference is how, you, how, how some agents handle a hit or handle a setback and keep going. And it was so like enlightening, if you will, or just like, yes, because that makes so much sense to me. And it is so, so very, very true. You know, I had, um, a training director when I was a brand new agent right out of college. And I remember always sort of lived by this and have told many, many other agents this, that I remember her saying very specifically, you know, there will be bad days in real estate days when you've worked so hard on something and it falls apart or, you know, there's rejection or there's whatever. And, um, no matter how bad it is or how much it sucks for lack of better words, you deal with it in that day and you move on. So it's a 24 hour rule. Um, you know, you have 24 hours or being that day, once that 24 hours is over, you know, once that day is over, basically you can't pout about it anymore. So if you have a really crappy day or something really terrible happens, or you face, you know, rejection on something, you know, listing, whatever it is, you know, if, if you're just in a foul mood and you can't get past it that day, that's fine ditch the rest of the day, whatever you have to do. But when you wake up the next morning, it's over, it's done, it's in the past and you move on. And that was such good advice because there's definitely been times where things happen and it's so frustrating or so, you know, negative or just so, um, a defeating, if you will. And I've always remembered that, you know, you deal with it that, that day, or you can bask in it that day, be pouty about it that day. Um, bombed, whatever, and you wake up the next morning and you keep on going. And it's the agents that stay in that sort of negative mindset or don't get past it or don't bounce back or don't take a hit and take it and keep on going. And that is so, so true. When I look around at other successful agents, it's the ones that say, you know what? You move on. So that is just such, it was such um, good advice and I 100% believe it and it's not something you hear very often. So if you're a new agent or your agent out there, think about how you take a hit and how you move on. So uh, anyways, these are my thoughts. If you have any questions or comments or you disagree, please feel free to email me at Jessica Edwards at Seacoast Realty. Dot com And of course, you can always check us out at thecarolinasfinest.com. Thanks so much for listening. Have a wonderful day.